The digital age, often called the information age, is a period in human history characterized by the widespread use of digital technology such as computers and the internet to create, share, and access information. It has transformed the way we communicate, work, and live, making information readily available and easily accessible to people around the world. This era has brought about significant changes in various aspects of society, from how we connect with others to how we conduct business and access knowledge. These technologies enable people to communicate information easily and rapidly. Digital technology became prevalent and widely used around the world. Information can be accessed easily, especially with the use of the internet. House chores and jobs are getting automated with the help of machines and equipment. An example of the digital age is the prevalence of smartphones. These pocket-sized devices combine computing power, internet connectivity, and a wide range of applications to enable people to communicate, access information, shop, navigate, and perform various tasks from virtually anywhere. They represent how digital technology has become an integral part of our daily lives, reshaping how we connect, work, and interact with the world around us. Mobile phones became very useful in every areas of life, in education, entertainment, jobs, and etc. Digital technologies have radically changed the way people work, consume, and communicate over a short period of time. So overall, the digital age drastically altered how people work, consume, and communicate. It accelerated the pace of information exchange, making the world more interconnected and accessible than ever before. This ongoing transformation continues to shape our daily lives and the future of society. Hi guys, my name is Ashley Nicole. So I will be discussing the help of ICT through entertainment. With the advent of new technologies, the world of entertainment is constantly evolving. Digital broadcasting has completely changed the way we experience television and radio. Cinema can now be found at the comfort of your home through application like Netflix and iFlix, etc. We get entertained by the content we see in Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. Computer gaming has also been an important influence in the development of graphical interfaces. Technology has been at forefront of changes in production and distribution of music. We can now listen to music and podcasts using Spotify. These are some of technologies we use for entertainment that arise in the digital world. So the next is the help of ICT through business. The impact of ICT on business is particularly significant. It empowers people to share a knowledge and advice instantaneously and set up an online shop or website at low cost, dramatically lowering the barriers to starting a business. As such, maturity is closely linked to economic growth. Businesses in today's life have promoted a lot with the coming of ICT. Its impact cannot be overemphasized. For example, ICT helps us to increase productivity in business with the use of social media platform for marketing and promotion. The use of websites now allow companies to develop new and cheaper way of offering customers with opportunities of buying goods and services at their convenient time and enhance the level of customer service. Online platform has been a marketplace where people can transact and communicate. The impact of ICT infrastructure on social business cannot be understated. I has made social impact affordable, social impact scalable, and enables new ways to connect and engage with local communities. That's all. ICT support the concept of open learning where the trust is upon enhanced student access and the development of student autonomy. 
ICT can play varied roles in developing an effective learning environment. Good day everyone. Uh, today I will discuss what is jobs and earnings. So having a jobs and earning money is a part of everyday life for most people, especially an adult. Dahil ang pagkakaroon ng trabaho at tumita ng pera sa pang-araw-araw na pamumuhay ay isang bahagi na sa buhay ng isang tao upang makapamuhay siya ng maayos dito sa mundo nating ginagalawan. At ano nga ba ang jobs and earnings? So, job refers to work or task. In other world, job can be introduced as a task of human being for society. So, ang trabaho ay isang gawain ng isang tao na maaari niya itong pagkakitaan o isang libangan. While earnings from employment means gross wage, salaries, tips, commissions, and net income from self-employment. Kaya ang pagkakaroon ng trabaho at kumita ng pera ay isang napakamahalagang aspeto sa buhay ng bawat tao upang makapamuhay ng maayos dito sa mundo. Technology change. Ito nagre-refer sa mga taong makalaman tungkol sa production ng kapital at machine. Ang pag sa technological development ay maaaring ikahantong sa pagtaas ng productivity of labor, capital, and other factors sa production. Included din ang creation of skill, new means of production, new ways of using raw materials, and widespread use sa technological advancement. Ang technology ay mas powerful way to take or kaniyang power sa nature sa kahit anong posibleng paraan. It also strengthens the human base. Professor Trimble said that technology change ay hindi lang improvement sa technical. It means more than that. The process of developing technological knowledge can be divided into following stage. First is formulating scientific principles. Second is apply these principles to solve technical problems. And the last one is the development of technical invention until commercial exploitation. ICT plays a vital role in medical research and innovation. High-performance computing and big data analysis enable researchers to process vast amounts of medical data, accelerating the discovery of new treatments and therapies. Artificial intelligence and machine learning alg algorithms alg Artificial intelligence and machine learning aid in medical imaging, interpretation, drug discovery, and predictive analytics for disease prevention. The healthcare industry also benefits from ICT in administrative tasks such as billing, scheduling, and inventory, management, and enhancing operational efficiency. However, the integration of ICT in healthcare must be coupled with robust security measures to protect sensitive patient data. Overall, ICT's influence in the healthcare sector continues to grow, leading to improved patient outcomes, enhanced research capabilities, and a more efficient healthcare ecosystem. <laughs>